Hey, what's going on everybody? Uh, this one is going to be on a program called Y, uh, I type in Y there, that's a alias for y'all, uh, Y Live Streamer. And the idea behind Live Streamer is uh, you're able to pull video directly from streaming sites without having to go to their site and using Flash and do all the commercials and everything. And to give you an example, I'm going to do, uh, well first off, let's take a look at my ZSH file here. And I'm gonna go to, I'm sorry, 300 Y, that's gonna go down 300 lines. Uh, so what this does is it uses, I think it uses something like this program called RTMP Dump and you can use this, you, ca you set up this sniff uh, program here or uh, function here. Uh, <clears throat> you run this, you start it, and then you run it on capture, you go to a live streaming site. Once that live stream comes in, it captures the URL, the, the line basically, all of this stuff, and then you paste it in, RTMP dump, and paste all that stuff in, you pipe it into whatever player you want, and then you'll have a live stream, an example, would be would be this IPTV uh, and the one that works is this one here so you can do it this way and it's going to go to this site it's going to go to live uh, it's going to use the Linux it's going to use this this stream and there you have Russia today uh, I'm not sure if you're going to actually be able to see it uh, sometimes when I'm recording you can't see live streams Turn that down so you can hear me. Uh, so this in player, you might actually not be able to see the video. But anyways, it's playing Russia today. So that's how. That's what basically what it does. Um, but it's much much easier to do um, this live streamer. So if we bring up live streamer and dash u, these are the plugins. So it'll do that function where you sniff and capture and then write that function for these sites stream, live stream YouTube. Uh, the ones you're gonna, the ones I use are Justin and Ustream. So it'll go there and it'll do it for you. So basically what you do, uh, you go to get out of that and get out of this. Uh, so what you do is you basically Lua kit, uh, open Justin TV. Okay, so this might start to delay a little bit. Apologize if it does. But, you know, you go to a site, uh, and you get this URL here. Uh, and so you double-click, or triple-click here, and in Lua Kid, if you hit YY, <clears throat> it'll yank it to the buffer. Uh, the reason you do that, you can't... Uh, you can't... Uh, copy and paste left you know right click in X term there is no uh, there is no uh, left click or right click so what you need to do is live streamer and if you yanked it you can center click oops I guess we got my center click so let's go back here and Y Y space center click Yep. Uh, three finger click in on a touchpad like this MacBook Air here will work. So in X, in X term you can't use uh, Control V or Control Shift V. So this will uh, this will look and say, okay, these you can do the 240p, 360, 480. There's actually a 720 version. Uh, but what uh, you want to look for is live or best. Um, a lot of times it's the same one. Sometimes the best is just by itself. If it's, if there is a best by itself, use that. If not, it's usually a live best. And then what you do is you, uh, basically the command is this, best. And it should come up with, so there it's, there it is in VLC. It's a blank screen right now, but it should buffer in. There it is. So that's how it works. Uh, I prefer to use mplayer. So when I write my, uh, then, then you just a fun matter of writing functions. So if we go to our ZSH or whichever, or bash SH, this will work the same. Uh, I have a whole bunch of these. So I have uh, CNN, Fox, uh, Simpsons, South Park. These are all in Justin TV. So you just go to Justin TV. Um, go back. 
go to live channels, entertainment, just go to series or just entertainment. And you get quite a bit here actually, you get new release movies. I believe one playing right now is uh, Band of Heroes. So I'm going to, uh, basically you just do the same thing. You click on this and I'm sure I'm going to have a delay because of all this uh, uh, flash that I have running. Apologize. But yeah, this one here, uh, new releases is playing uh, the last or the last three days or whatever that is. So I'm going to cancel out of that. And I'm going to close the look it because it's probably taking up a bunch. So I have one of these in here. So I have movies, new releases. Uh, it's one of these two in that movie that was just playing. So if I want to play it, I'll do live movies. And probably this one here that we just looked at. It should come up. There it is. The next three what, what are you going to do? Are you going to burn me out? Yeah. That's what I'm going to do. Jeez. So there you go. Uh, so the uh, command is this. Uh, just install live streamer. Um, this dash M player puts it in M player instead of a VLC. If you didn't have that, then it would uh, just open in VLC. But yeah, you can go through Justin TV and Ustream and pick the ones you like and write this little function here. You know, just live streamer, p dash PM player if you want that. That uh, URL from the bottom of the page. Space live, close it out, and you should have a good uh, access to streaming movies and series. You know, say I want to watch The Simpsons. Series. And if you have ZSH, you can com you can automatically compete complete. And there's so what this oop that one didn't work. So how about uh, South Park? Sometimes. Well, somebody get Tyler Perry to shut up. Please, and yeah, this this channel mind. basically will just right. keep looping. You keep looping. <coughs> excuse me, episodes. Uh, kind of in a random order, as far as I can tell, for all the all the Simpsons uh, versions or, or uh, episodes that have, have been created. So, yeah, that's it. If you have any questions about that, <clears throat> let me know. Take care.